the challenge was to give uh, answer what is the problem for example with the in the compressor in a very short time uh, because the production is going the, the the mass productions didn't stop the, the we produce and uh, when we find the problem we need to react very quickly we need to know what is inside we need to know what kind of materials uh, can contaminate compressors what size of, of these contamination particles are. So generally without phenom, such kind of microscope, we cannot achieve such information. The system uh, surprised me that it see the, these particles in very, very details. Tiny particles uh, was so, so much detailed and it was the big wow. The best thing of usage of the phenom particle X is easiness of the of the usage because we need to put the filters, make a program, press play, and the hard stuff is made by the microscope. After short training, uh, give opportunity to operator to uh, quite advanced usage of the of the microscope. The, this special holder which have four, four places to, to filters, which we can put into the microscope in one, uh, one setup. So generally we, we don't need to set filter one by one, which also take time, but we put one, one, one set, so four filters, and uh, press play, and we have analysis. We found unexpected things, yes, uh, which we cannot imagine on the beginning of the, of the analysis. The whole development of how to use the microscope, uh, how to perform the, 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 the procedures and, and so on, we made uh, ourselves with, uh, I think, big, big help of Thermo Fisher guys. We need to improve all the time. We need to search new solutions and uh, the microscope is, I think, one of them. <laughs>